Hey everyone, Richard here, and welcome to another comic haul. Uh, this is a really small haul, uh, but it's sort of a special one. Um, but let's get into it. So these first three books I got from my comic shop, uh, I recently sent in a bunch of uh, basically filler books from my collection to, uh, for trade credit with them. Uh, the nice thing about that is I got more trade credit than I probably would have got if I had just sold them straight to eBay, so a nice little deal there. But I managed to get three books I needed. Amazing Spider-Man number 56. This is the first appearance of George Stacy, uh, Gwen Stacy's father, and well, at one point a very prominent uh, police officer in New York for uh, Marvel. Next I got this book right here. Amazing Spider-Man number 78. First appearance of Prowler. Uh, as some of you probably already know, most of you probably already know, uh, Prowler sort of makes an appearance, or the person who is Prowler makes an appearance in uh, Spider-Man Homecoming, so really cool book to have. Uh, it's in pretty decent shape, just a subscription increase, and those don't usually bother me, so pretty happy to have that. And the last one from my comic shop, Amazing Spider-Man number 90. This is the death of Captain Stacy, so I got his first appearance and his death. Um, this is important for a bunch of reasons that I'll probably talk about in another video. Uh, but really why this is a special haul is because with this book right here, I have completed my Amazing Spider-Man run from 50 to 100, which was the last thing I needed to complete my 2017 wish list. So I've actually completed my 2017 wish list uh, in this haul. So really, really happy about that. Um, I'll definitely do a, I guess, a collection update showing uh, Amazing Spider-Man 50 through 100 and talking about those books. Uh, in the future. And then I have one other book. Uh, this one I didn't get from my comic shop. I actually purchased this one uh, locally. Um, I entirely blame Alex the Comic Order for this purchase. He sort of gave me the bug. It is this book right here. Flash Comics number 64. The Golden Age book uh, from April of 1945. Uh, so it's a World War II book. Um, Really, really happy to add this to my collection. Uh, it is a first appearance. It's the first appearance of Monocle, who is a sort of a... He's not a major character in DC, but he's a minor villain. Uh, he's made, He made an appearance in Identity Crisis. Uh, and he also had a cameo in uh, an animated series. Um, I was going to do a unlocking key issues on this book, but it's a little more fragile than I really want to openly handle very often. Uh, so I'll show a picture of basically his first appearance in the book. Um, just really, really happy to have this, uh, and to have a Golden Age key issue, even if it's a, a minor key issue, it's still a really fun thing to have. Um, yeah. Uh, not much more I could say about it. It's a very early, uh, Joe Kubert Hawkman, uh, so that's really cool. Uh, 62 is his first, uh, Hawkman work, and he became pretty well known for his Hawkman stuff, so that's also really cool. Um, just happy to have it. Uh, I plan to get more Golden Age comics, at least a few. Um, not going to start a huge collection of them, but I, I like having at least a few to, to show. Uh, so yeah, that's really all there is to this haul. Like I said, not a very big one, but one I'm very happy about. Uh, super happy to finish my 2017 list. Uh, basically means I need to start thinking about what I want to look for next. Um, but yeah, that's really all I have to share. I hope you're all doing well, and take care.